Now, meteorologist Jamie Jarosik and your Storm Team 2 forecast. We have temperatures that continue to drop this morning as skies are clearing out across the area. We are down to 40 degrees in Dayton. Looking to the west, that's where the coldest air is. 33 in Lafayette, 30 in Terre Haute, and Springfield is 30 degrees. Uh, quite cold. That air is settling in where we've seen some clearing. That's where it is coldest at the moment. Bell Fountain 36, 36 in Greenville, 34 in Richmond. We have 37 in Eaton, still 40 in Dayton, but with those skies clearing out, we're all going to drop. Even the southeastern counties will likely hit the upper 30s as the morning goes on. This morning and then again tonight, we have some frost and freeze concerns. So we do have a frost advisory in effect for all of our counties. Freeze warnings to the west. Again, just another night tonight that you'll want to protect your plants as we're going to get quite cold. If you're heading out this morning for a walk again, it's going to be pretty chilly early on, but we have a lot of sunshine in the forecast today. So a nice cool fall day 37 at 8 a.m. By lunchtime, we're going to be into the upper 40s and then highs will hit the mid 50s right around 55 at 4 o'clock. Pretty much at any point you're heading out for that walk, you'll want to have at least a light jacket or a sweatshirt. Tomorrow morning looks even colder with our temperature dropping all the way down to 33. Outlying spots could even go below freezing, so well below that normal in the mid 40s. We'll actually come back up closer to normal over the next several days, so uh, just a couple of mornings in the 30s, and then we have some nice recovery. It's all happening behind this cold front that is now well off to our east. The rain behind the front heading away from us, and you can see that cloud line uh, continuing to work across the area as high pressure builds in. It's going to keep us dry for a few days. We have very low rain chances right on through Sunday. Sunday evening is when that rain chance will start to come back up. It will continue to go up Sunday night and then even into Monday as a disturbance crosses the region. Here's a check of future tracks starting us off nice and quiet. Again, cold but dry and sunny through lunchtime and still mostly sunny even late in the day at 5 o'clock. Tonight looks mostly clear as we drop back into the 30s. And then tomorrow after a cold morning, it's going to be a nice afternoon. We'll get a little bit warmer than today and we should stay mostly sunny. Here's your forecast today. Lots of sunshine, nice and cool with highs near 55. It's not going to be as breezy as it was yesterday. Overnight, another cold one down to 33. A uh, clear sky, so frost is likely and a freeze is possible in many spots. And tomorrow we'll have some nice recovery up near 60 with plenty of sunshine on Saturday. Sunday is partly sunny and we have the chance of an evening shower. Highs push into the low 60s. Rain is likely Sunday night and will continue as we go into Monday. Temperatures drop just a touch early next week, but then we get a warming trend. Mid 60s Tuesday, upper 60s Wednesday, close to 70 Thursday with slight rain chances.